Hello everyone. In this part, we will see C program to subtract two matrices of order n by n. In previous video, we learned how to accept a two-dimensional array or how to read the matrix from the user. Here, we will read the two matrix from the user and we will subtract this element as this two. So, for this, we need to apply some steps. Suppose consider this is first array 5, 6, 7, 8. This is two dimensional array or a consider the matrix. This is your first matrix, this is your second matrix. And when you are subtracting elements, see, we need to write the A of 2, 2 minus B of 2, 2. Okay, but here we need to subtract element, this 0, 0 location element minus 1. Consider this is A of 0, 0 minus B of 0, 0. So, you will get this element here, 4. Okay. So, consider this array as a C. Okay. This array, first array as a A, second array as a B. And you will get the output C. So, how you will get this 4? So, for this, you need to write A of 0, 0. Okay. A of 0, 0. 0. So, you need to write in this way first. A of 0, then 0. So, you will get this 5 element. A of 0, 0 means 5. Minus B of 0, 0. Okay. So, you will get the new element and we will store this element at the location C of 0, 0. So, what is A of 0, 0? A of 0, 0 is 5. Okay, A of 0, 0 is 5. So, A of 0, 0 minus B of 0, 0. B of 0, 0 is 1. So, we will consider here 1. Okay, and then we will get the output 4. So, we will store this 4 at the C of 0, 0. So, how to write the program for the same? So, first you need a 1. First you need 2 two dimensional array of order m by n. So, first accept the number of rows and number of columns in this matrices. So, read the first matrix, then read the second matrix. Subtract this element of the second matrix from the first and then you will get this resultant matrix, then print this matrix. So, you need to follow these steps. So, let's start hash include Pdio dot h okay. standard input output dot h here we will start our program each main so here okay here we will write each we need a i we need a j we need a m okay m is for the rows number of rows number of columns like the n okay then we need a two matrix we know that now we will take the maximum size. Okay, here we will declare the maximum size A of 5, 5. So, maximum you can take the A of 2 by 2 or A of 3 by 3. From this location, you can use the only some spaces. But see, this is a vestige of memory when you are declaring the last spaces A of 10, 10. So, 10, 10 means 10 into 10, you are reserving the 100 spaces. Okay, here A of then again write here A, uh, sorry, you have already mentioned the A, so now write the B, okay. B of 5, 5, or you can just consider the A of 2, 2, B of 2, 2, and the C of 2, 2 also, okay. Here, write in this way. Then, print tape to the message to the user, how many rows and columns in matrix. Okay, so user will enter this some value here. Okay, user will enter the value. How many rows and how many columns. So, read this value from the user. So, number of rows and number of columns. So, you need to write the two times percentage. Number of row is M, comma. Number of column is N. So, write the address of M, comma, N. Then, Accept the first row. So, here write the printf. Accept first 
the matrix. Okay, first matrix from the user of M by of M by N say means if you are entering the two by two or three by two or two by three then you need to accept the this type of matrix here. Okay, so for i equal to zero, then i less than c. You need to write the here m now because number of rows here you are taking this m i plus c. Okay, so number of rows is the two, then it will execute this two times. Then here for j equal to zero, j less than n and j plus plus. Okay, right away j plus plus. J equals to zero, then we will put the semicolon j less than n and j plus two. And here read the first matrix element. Can it first in the because here we are reading the one by one element and here mention the A of I J number of rows and here uh, I means the row location, column location, A of I J. So read the first matrix. Okay. So here we write the return zero and you can check the only this uh, uh, only this part just click on a run okay so you will get the here how many rows and columns suppose the, i want the two rows and uh, two columns only so accept the matrix from the user suppose two by two means you need a four element six eight three and four okay yes it's correct this program is now accepting the four element for the first matrix. Okay, so just we copy the first accept this matrix, then select this part, paste here, display, right here, display first matrix. Okay, display first matrix. Then here. We are change this scanf into printf. Printf display the all the elements. Here you need to write the printf. Why to write the printf? Because we need to print the remaining element on a second row. So see when you are accepting the element 5, 6. Then after that we need to go on the next line. We need to print this element 7, 8 on the next line. So that's why only here we are taking this slash n. Okay, so display the first matrix of size n by n. Again we will copy all this part, copy this part and then paste here. Okay, here accept now. Second matrix element. Right here, second matrix element. Here we are considering the second matrix is B. Okay. Then display second matrix element. Or display matrix B. Display matrix B of size M by N. Or you can write the display second matrix of M by N size. So you need to specify the here also B. Now you have two matrix. Okay. Till this part we completed the program. Now 5, 6, 7, 8 is with us. Then 1, 2, 3, 1. So now two matrices is there. Now we need to subtract this element. So how to write the code for this? So write here print F slash N subtract two matrices. Okay. Subtract two matrices. How to subtract? So for this also we need again this loops. We need this part. So copy this part. See here. For i equals to 0, i less than m, i plus plus. For j equals to 0, they less than n, j plus plus. And here we will write c equals to c of i j. C of i j equals to a of i j 
minus b of i j. Okay, and do the semicolon here. Okay, c of i j equal to a of i j minus b of i j. And then print tab here in print percent c of i j only. Okay, here we print the c of i j. Okay, so let's execute this program. Just click on a run to run this code. See, here is some error. Okay, subtract to matrices. So, here we need to put this in equal. Just click on a run. Suppose number of rows and number of columns is 2, 2. Then read the first matrix. Here I am taking the 1, 2, 4, 3. This is your first matrix. Suppose. Display the first matrix 1, 2, 4, 3. See, we need to specify the space here between the 1 and 3. Otherwise, it will look like a 12. Okay. Accept the second matrix from the user. Okay. Second matrix of size m by n. First element, uh, my first element in the second matrix is 0, then 1, then 2, then again 2. Okay. So, see. Subtraction of two matrix. Here subtraction is the first element is, first is got output one. So what is the first element of the first matrix? Okay, so one one minus zero is one here. Okay, then two. Second element of the first row is two. Uh, see two minus one is one. Then four four minus two is two, and then three minus two is one. Okay. Just you need to do the here spaces. So how to do this? See you got this output. This output is correct. So where to maintain this space? See we need to do the space here. When we are displaying here. Then again. Here also write the slash n. So this output will be on a next line. Okay. So. Here also, when you are displaying this, do the space here and this here are the slash n. Again, click on a run to check the output. How many rows and columns? 2 by 2. Suppose, accept the first matrix element. Suppose, first matrix element 5, 5, 5, 5. Okay, this is your suppose first matrix. Then, second matrix element. Suppose, second matrix elements are 7, 7, 7. 7. Okay. These are the second matrix elements. Then you will get the output. Subtract, subtract the two matrix. So here is your output. Okay. So in this way you can subtract the two matrix. Here change the heading. Subtraction of two matrices. So you will get the proper output. This is subtraction of two matrices. Okay. See. What do you need to do? First, you need to declare the matrices here. Then specify number of rows and number of columns. Then accept the first matrix. After that, display the first matrix. Okay. Then accept the second matrix. Display the second matrix. And use the same code. And subtract this uh, B from the A. So, A of IJ equals to B of IJ. So, you will get the C of IJ. Write the C of IG here and close the program. See this program, uh, this is 53 line code. But you need to uh, copy and paste this code only. But try to understand the logic behind it. You know the how to subtract the matrix, how to add the matrix. Just you need to specify, you need to represent it in a uh, program. Okay, so for this, just you need to use this nested for Okay, thank you. And if you have any query regarding this, please type it in the comment box. If you have not subscribed yet to my channel, please subscribe to my channel for new videos. Press the bell icon also.